One way that a lot of people find helpful for getting new clients is doing a complimentary call. Some people call this a discovery call or a clarity session or a strategy call or an exploratory session. It's basically a free call or free meeting that you give to prospective clients to get a sense of how you work with clients and also for you to get a sense of whether they would be an ideal client. Let me just give you a really simple framework for such a call. Basically, in, let's say you were doing a 30-minute complimentary call, uh, and I'm going to share with you how I do it. So basically, for the first 27 minutes, I do my best to help the person move forward in their business or in their marketing because I help people with with growing their business and doing marketing in an authentic way. So for the first 27 minutes, I help them do that as best as I can. And and here's the thing, I try to explain things in a way that is understandable to them, that's not too intimidating. And I continually gauge by what, because I do these over video conferencing, I use a, a software called Zoom, Z-O-O-M dot U-S wonderful piece of software. You can also use Skype. Uh, but if, as I keep giving them advice, and, and it's sort of a dance between asking them for some context of their issues, their challenge, so I can give them the right kind of advice that I've seen work for my clients or work for myself. And then I keep gauging as I share my advice with them, whether it's resonating with them or whether it's confusing them. And if it's resonating with them, then I'll give some more details. If it's confusing them, then what I typically do is ask them if they have any questions or I start to share a different method. It's like, oh, another way that's worked well in this situation is this and this and this. So I really um, spend 27 minutes helping that prospective client the best that I can. And actually, one thing I should say is at the beginning of the call, I actually say to them, this is a time where I'm going to do my best to share with you advice that will help you move forward while getting to also getting to know what uh, your situation is and who you are. And at the end of the call, I, um, we can talk about how I work with clients and answer any questions you have. How does that sound? Great, okay, let's keep going. So then for those 27 minutes, I do my best to help them out. And then the final three minutes, I then shift gears, which means I have to look at the clock. I shift gears to say, all right, so we're at the end of our call, and do you have any questions for how I work with clients, or um, uh, yeah, do you have any questions for me? And, and then I, I answer their questions. Um, now, sometimes during the course of the call, it becomes clear that really I am not the best fit for them at this time in, in serving them. Then I spend the last three minutes suggesting that they, they consider another resource or uh, another person I can refer them to, et cetera, okay? So you can feel free to use this format for your own complimentary calls as well. Now, um, if you find that this helps you to get new clients, now I should say that uh, out of every 10 complimentary calls that you do, even if you get two or three people who become clients, that's pretty good. Now, if you're getting only one or two, you know you need to work on um, who you're inviting to be a, to, to to join you on a complimentary call, or you need to work on how you are doing those calls and come f more from a place of service and more from a place of clarity. Don't try to don't overwhelm them. Speak slowly and try to do better at gauging whether they are resonating with what you're saying, okay? But really try to aim for at least three to five out of 10 complimentary calls becoming your clients, okay? Um, now, how do you get people to say yes to joining you on a complimentary call? So let me give you a strategy for that. So this is called a complimentary call launch. And you can do this several times a year, let's say two to four times a year, or really, uh, so I think that's a, probably a good rhythm for, for how often you do this. If you, if you need clients, do this two to four times a year. And basically, this is where you reach out to your warm contacts, your email list subscribers, or you post this on your Facebook, or you reach out by email to several supportive friends and colleagues. But you basically reach out and let people know that during a course of two weeks, it can be two to four weeks, 
you are focused on giving 20, it can be, pick a number, 20 or 30 complimentary calls uh, so that you can really give people a sense of how you work and, uh, and fill some, some um, availability you have at this time in your, in your client uh, portfolio, right? Or however you want to call it, client base, or you have some room to serve more clients. And uh, here is a basic template you can use. And I'm going to say September 15 to 30 is that time frame you're doing a complimentary call launch, but you can use whatever dates. So from September 15 to 30, I'm focused on giving complimentary coaching sessions to 20 people who are, who, uh, are interested in solving this particular challenge in their life, whatever that challenge is. During these sessions, I will help you and describe who you are. So this, I will help this type of person create this type of transformation, okay? If that describes you, I encourage you to request a session uh, by, by messaging me, or you can just, just have them message you or clicking on a link to schedule a session. Or if this describes a friend or colleague, please forward this message to them. Thank you so much for helping me fill uh, the available spots I have in my in my client pro portfolio right now. Okay, so again, mer uh, modify this template to your own voice, but that's the basic message you are saying. And so, what is the time frame for this complimentary call launch? Let's say that you send this email. What I would encourage. Let's say you send this email on September first. Okay. Now again, the 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 law, the the time you're going to do these calls, you're focused on doing them September 15 to 30. Let's say, so let's say you send this email up on September 1st, then you send a reminder email around September 10. So give them about a week or 10 days to to respond, and then finally, if you still need to fill those complimentary call spots, send another reminder email around September 20. So really, part way through your your, your complimentary call launch, okay? And who should you send this to? Send this to your email list subscribers. Send, send this to a group of supportive friends and colleagues who may want to spread the word for you. And also feel free to post this and also send it to your clients. If you have any clients already or previous clients, send this to them as well. And if you have social media like you, you share on Facebook or LinkedIn or Twitter or Google Plus or wherever you share it, share this there as well so try this out uh, again you can do this two to four times a year when you need clients and let me know if you have any questions by commenting on this video and i look forward to seeing if this strategy also helps you to fill your client base